Hey guys, does this background looks familiar to you? Yeah, it's the old background. So, I'm thinking about this very long for a very long time and I will use the old background and the new background time by time and see which one is suitable for the video that I'm shooting. And for this video, I'm going to change the genre, the types a little bit. As you can see in the title, I won't be I won't be doing a video about type of anything I will be doing a new content with a new title it's called struggles that only student understands hey guys let's get into this quick without further more talking bullshit let's jump into the first struggle that only student understands the late for school so let's get real here every student is at least one time late for school but what reason do they give for me I give a reason that the traffic is jammed and sometimes it, that is true but sometimes it's fake but when it's true I give the teacher that the reason of I'm getting late to the school is that the traffic is jammed as hell but then the teacher will 100% accuse me for being sleeping late rather than speaking the truth that the traffic is jammed and sometimes you, meet, you will meet the clutch game and what I mean clutch game is like the time when you get late to school is 7.30 okay so when you go, get down the car it's like 7 and 29 minutes so you need to punch card and get to the class quick in one minute so that's what I call a clutch game and you your whole life and your whole progress from you getting off the car and from you to the class will be like mission impossible and you'll be like Tom Raider and Lara Croft and you do all those stunts and end up getting late into the class again. Hmm. John is late for school again. I can't wait to punish him like hell and get him into detention. Hey teacher, oh my god, it's it's a tragedy out there. It's like traffic jam all the way and I just killed a dragon. And then I saved the world from Apocalypse and then I slay another King Kong and I slay another lizard and I meet Spider-Man and all that shit and I'm just late one minute. Can you give me like a chance? Just one minute and I do all those good shit. Yeah sure John. You've been a good boy uh, all along this year. Surely I will give you a chance. That's just one minute late. I can give you the chance man. Phew. Man. Thank you teacher, this was never expected man. Hey John, do you know why me forgiving you is a very unexpected thing? You know why? Let me tell you something. Because that is never going to happen. Screw you. Happy birthday having detention. And meet me in the discipline room. Have a nice day all guys. John is being a bastard right now. Damn it teacher, I just saved the world from apocalypse and then you're not even leaving here without me. And it's just one minute. Oh, I, oh. The second struggle that only students understand. Before the exam. And let's be here, real here. Everybody wants to pass the exam and get good grades and good marks. But no one really wants to put effort in it. So, it's never going to happen. You're not going to get good grades or good marks without paying effort in it. So let's just take it in, take it in. When you really decide that you want to read for the exam and give it all you got, this is going to happen. Okay man, this is now or never. I've been feeling the exam for like 6 years and this is now or never. For this year, I'm finally going to success. I'm going to be a new self. It's going to be the start of a happy shit. It's going to be the start of my empire, my legacy. My legacy in academy is going to start this year where I start to read everything and pass the freaking exam. Oh wait, Jeff just sent me a message. Let's check what message that Jeff sent.
fine man i'm stupid okay god made me stupid i'm okay with it i'm totally okay with it what's the importance in marks anyways i don't care about marks marks can't bring you anywhere right man exams are just a number and it's just a show of something that you're good at and i can be good at anything so just yolo my exams exams are not very important in my life i can do whatever i want and put my passion in it and find my future in it my future career doesn't need to do with exams so now i don't need to be damn good at it so i don't need to read anything Number three, your busy life. So, if you are a student, right here, right now, you are watching this video as a student, post this video, share this video to your friend, and wait for the message, and I bet your friend will relate this video to everything I said later, and he will basically reply you with, I know, right? So, every people is busy, right? Okay, I, I mean every people is busy. Your parents are busy, workers are busy, every, everybody is busy. But then, students are busy at a very stupid thing, I don't know why. Okay, so before exam, you read for the exam and do homeworks. And after exam, you have projects and assignments to finish. And after the projects finish, and it's in the holiday, you still need to do the holiday homework and all those holiday assignments that you need to pass up after the holiday. So basically, what does holiday mean? Actually, if you go find the definition of holiday, it will come around along the lines like where you rest and don't need to do things or you like take a rest from or a break or anything. Right here, right now as a student, holiday for us really literally means schooling at home or maybe learning something boring not in the school that's basically the definition of holiday and then homeworks are homeworks okay at least you give me reasonable homeworks but no that's a those are not reasonable homeworks man you sure teachers one plus one equals two okay you get it right you get it john john you get it now you all whole class go back home Finish the homework for chapter 1 to the whole book. Teacher, you didn't teach us how to finish the whole homework, man. You just teach us how to finish 1 plus 1 equals 2. And the whole homework is full of questions that doesn't involve 1 plus 1 equals 2. And many other things harder than that. Shut up, John, with a smiley face. You think you have a smiley face you can win? You know what? When I was at your age... I need to complete a single freaking homework, a book, a whole book in a day, each day that the teachers tell us to do. And now, what am I giving you? I'm giving you to do finish a freaking whole book of exercise in a week. Is that very hard? Is that too much to ask for? Phew, students nowadays. And last but not least, the the very very nightmare of every student and every student struggles the school opening this struggle does not affect on every student but it only affects on students that procrastinate much like me if you know me i'm actually a guy that procrastinate much actually so when it comes to holidays there's holidays homework and assignment and i won't do those things until the last day of the holiday which is a day before the opening school so when school opens i won't be able to finish things so be a day before it i will be very very nervous and i will do all my power to finish the assignments and the homeworks because i haven't done anything so i will stay up very very late and drink a cup of coffee latte cappuccino americano anything some caffeine to boost me for the whole night, non-sleep, I, I won't sleep until I finish my homework and assignments. But then I, with all the time of, the, of sleeping cancelled, I still can't finish my homework and assignments because it involves ho the whole holiday. I don't do it the, for the whole holiday, so I can't imagine myself doing it in one night. So, but I still ended up staying for the whole night and I got those 
black thing in my eyes which I already have right now if you clearly see on it and I will literally look like a panda and that's actually a very sucking thing when you look like a panda at your first day to school and you give your first new teacher the impression of you staying up late like a drunk and ended up like a panda except for pandas are cute and you are not oh my god guys if you are offended as a teacher or a student in any way that you're offended I'm sorry and this is just for entertainment and also my personal comments and suggestion for struggles that only students understand it doesn't have to do with anything publicly or anything that this needs to change about the system of schooling so we are cool man this is just entertainment and my own opinion so guys if you like the video please like comment and subscribe and please 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 share because you i mean a good video like this you can share it to your friends and he will reply you something like i know right okay so just share and i love you bye guys